morning, beautiful people. Um, well, morning for you guys, not morning for us, although we have been taking it really easy this weekend and <laughs> taking some naps and all of that. We went to church this morning and it was really beautiful. Yeah. And it's just been a really quiet, slow kind of weekend, which I thoroughly enjoy. Um, lots of family time, lots of sweet moments, and so that's been really good. Um, but we have a few things going on here, and I was wanting to do some like food prep and maybe make a few homemade snacks and treats for the kids that they can be using this upcoming week for school. And so um, the girls and I were talking about a couple of recipes that we used to make all the time. And so I wanted to pull those out today. I'm gonna have the kids kind of help me a little bit. Some of the kids are busy today though. Um, the boys have been playing basketball outside with the, the kids <laughs> like down the street. Non-stop. Non-stop, non-stop. And then Penelope's friend is down the street as well. And so they've been kind of off doing their own thing. Yeah. Um, and then Jude's about to go to youth group in just a minute with some friends. And Liam's at a thing with some friends his age. And he, um, and Penelope's actually not feeling well today. She's yeah. got like a really bad stomach ache. And so her and Reese stayed home from church today and just watched online. But the rest of us went in, uh, over to church today. And so that was really nice. But we're just kind of having a quiet weekend. Taking and a little nap. I didn't mean to take a nap. But he just laid down and passed fell out. asleep. <laughs> yeah, the kids were laughing because you know when you're so tired that you like have your mouth hanging open sleeping? <laughs> that was him this afternoon. It was actually kind yeah. of funny, but um, I'm I, I'm just like so grateful for these quieter kind of days and, and a slower yesterday, pace. Yesterday you made dish. Yeah, That's recent right. eat bird, bird house. And what does it say over here? It says E plus E plus R, yeah. That means Ethan and Reese. Ethan and Reese. Reese has been doing all these cute little crafts and things with the little kids, and so that's been really sweet. But they love to paint, so we did a little birdhouse. We could go hang that on one of the trees at the at the property. Do you want to do that? Sure. I bet you a bird would come and stay in it. That'd be pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah, that's so cool. I like that color blue too. It's really nice. Yeah, we mixed white and blue. White and blue together. That's beautiful. That's awesome. Do you want to help me make some delicious snacks yes. and stuff? You do? Yes. <laughs> he's my, he's, he's like he's my little baker. Say. He's always my yes. best little baker, aren't you? Mm -hmm. Are you really, are you going to like stir in the chocolate chips yes. and stuff? Yeah, that's kind of like your favorite hey, thing hey. to do, isn't it? So I had a couple of things I wanted to make today. One of the things that we used to make all the time for the kids is these little peanut butter oat chocolate chip balls. It's like no bake and it's like four or five ingredients, super easy. Really but you make a bunch of these little balls and then you can stick them in a container in the refrigerator and it's got some protein, it's a little bit sweet, um, but the kids love to have that in their lunch boxes or after school snacks, yeah. um, as well as some apple cinnamon cream cheese muffins. That's one of our favorites. And this week we've had a few days that kind of felt like fall, guys. They really do. It's starting to feel really good in the morning. This morning yeah. was one of them. I know, I know. Like I'm getting all the fall vibes and it so- It got down in the 60s one night. I know, it's and like, and we've had some rain too. There was like a big thunderstorm yeah. yesterday that came through. So we were just all snuggled up inside yeah. while it was just pouring down rain. Um, so I've just it's kind of a, been in a baking mood. It or, is a totally different vibe whenever it's raining outside and you're not in an RV. Yeah. <laughs> like yesterday we were like, yeah. oh, this is so refreshing. <laughs> we love the rain. We're still a few months away from moving into our home yeah. that is gonna be so great, but uh, I'm getting really excited about that too because I was actually purchasing some of the appliances the other day. <laughs> I was actually terrified to do this, guys. So um, the double oven that we're ordering, it's really beautiful. I'm really excited. It, it is really It has nice, been guys. kind of sold out on a lot of places, and so I found a site that had it in yeah. stock, um, and it's like a, a two to three month wait. So like you kind of need to order it now so it's that it's sweet. in before you know, you're supposed to move into the house. And so Steven's like, okay, go ahead and purchase it. I'm like, I am so afraid to make these big purchases, even though like I know that you have yeah. to do that. This is for the house and there's a budget for it and all of that, but it's still kind of scary. Like It's you a just... very different feeling. You're like, yeah. am I allowed to? Yeah, am I really supposed to be doing that? <laughs> it's so weird because you just wait and wait and wait, yeah. what seems like forever, and then uh, you finally get down to it. I'm gonna show you real life here real quickly, guys. <laughs> what is going on over here? <laughs> While Steven and I are talking away, we've got some little wrestlers over here. I was showing them <laughs> jiu-jitsu earlier today. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Ethan, I don't know if you're any match for Jude here. <laughs> <laughs> He's gotcha. Something that's funny is we actually bought Jude some new pants because his pants were like mega, mega high waters on him. Yeah. We bought him men's pants for the first time. Yeah, they're a little bit wide. And they're still not 
they're tall not, enough for him. Yeah, he. Like. I got the size 30 in length, and they were still super short on him. Amazing, so we we man. got. Um, we're it's ordering some 32s. Legs. I just need to take you to the store and let you pick out some stuff, right? Yeah. But yeah, this is happening every three months or so. We've got like <laughs> another another clothing haul for him. So. Time for our monthly clothing haul for you, Jude. Yeah. <laughs> so Lincoln's out for a nap, but he's probably about to wake up, and I know yeah. that he's gonna wanna help with the cooking and all the baking and all the good stuff. The ultimate Even foodie. if all the other kiddos are kind of doing their own thing today, yeah. he is our foodie, along with Ethan over here, is ready, and uh, so it's gonna be a fun little day. The girls awesome. might help out a they little might, bit yeah. too, but um, yeah, it's just a different vibe when you have older kids and everyone's kind of yeah. going their own directions yeah. and stuff, but I'm glad that we got to have plenty of family time this weekend yes. and so it'll be fun to kind of put together some snacks and treats for them to enjoy all week long. So Jude's trying on a couple of things. They were trying to figure out if he fits them or if they need to be taken back. But I really like corduroy pants for like Thanksgiving and Christmas and that kind of thing. And this green sweater here with like a bunch of different textures. That looks really nice on you. Do you like that one? Not really. Not really? Oh it's so it nice feels and versatile. A little weird. I'm oh. gonna have to wear like an undershirt on there. Yeah usually with sweaters. So like, like Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. <laughs> like special occasions and that kind of thing. I'm gonna go wear this to school. Yeah. Pretty much every single thing for fall um, last year does not fit you anymore. So yeah. we're gonna have to definitely stock back up on pants and jeans and sweaters and all that good stuff. But that color looks really good on you. I like it. <laughs> some little mini chocolate chips because they are easier to just mix into um, and especially if you're just gonna have like a bite size amount it's easier ah! to just have like small pieces of chocolate chips. Lincoln approves of the little mini chocolate chips and so we've got all the ingredients in the bowl you approve and uh, so Ethan's gonna help me mix these up and then we will taste them and see if they're good and then pop them into the fridge for everyone to enjoy all week. The kids are gonna be so grateful that you're such a good helper huh? Yeah. You know, every time they eat one of these, they're gonna say, wow, I'm so glad that Ethan is such an excellent helper. It's mixing time. It's mixing time. So here's the final result of our delicious peanut Ooh. butter balls. Does that look good, Lincoln? We're gonna put it in the fridge for a little bit and let it kind of harden up. Yeah, so these just go into the refrigerator for maybe an hour or two so that they can get nice and solid. And then we'll eat them, won't we, Lincoln? Boo. 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 Good job, Bubby. 
Did you use all the colors? Look at how pretty that is. That's good, Lincoln. You guys, Linky's making a beautiful picture over here. Look at all those nice colors. See, I like to use all the colors of the rainbow, huh? Oh. <laughs> wow, that was a nice long kiss, huh? Look at this, guys, that is so pretty. So I'm cutting up a bunch of apples for some apple cinnamon cream cheese muffins. How does that sound? Really good. Kira's eating some cheese and some apples, which is also a really good thing. So I'm just gonna finish cutting up the apples and get all the ingredients mixed in. And then in just a minute, Steven here is going to start on dinner. And it's one of my favorite things. He um, makes this sandwich that is very similar to, what is going on? I didn't even see what's going on. <laughs> lovely, lovely. <laughs> He's like, like him at all. <laughs> wow, Linky. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> um, this sandwich is something that I discovered in a restaurant in uh, Chicago. Have we vlogged this before? I'm sure I've talked about it because it's like my favorite sandwich I don't know if we've made ever. it before or not, but um, we're putting a bit of a different twist on it. I've got kind of a light on me. It kind of looks fun. It's usually, I call it usually the, um, the Thanksgiving sandwich. Yeah. Because it's got like a cranberry chutney that I make, but you can't get cranberries anywhere right now. I've tried to find them yeah. at a few different stores. It's a bit early. So we're gonna make it with peach instead. So it'll be a little more, you know, fall slash whatever. A summery fall. Summery, place. summery fall, like on the brink of fall. <laughs> which is where we which are is right where now. where we are right now. I think that'll be. I, nice. I'm obsessed with peaches too, and so I feel like peach mixed with brie and turkey and sourdough um, should be really delightful. Sometimes we do this with pretzel bread, but or pretzel buns, um, but it's really hard to find organic pretzel buns that are not enriched, and I try to stay away from grains that are enriched because I can't do the <laughs> synthetic just, folic acid. Just he has out. probably eaten like two whole apples oh at this point. But, um, so I'm just gonna finish this up, and then once we're done with the muffins, we'll get started on dinner. But I know that the kids are gonna very much enjoy yes. the sandwiches. Oh, thank you. He is so huggy with you today. He is super huggy. I'm all right with it. I know. All the hugs for me. You love your daddy so much. <laughs> Can I have a kiss? <laughs> <laughs> You're so sweet. together now for the muffins and I'm gonna go ahead and put them in the muffin pan and top it with some brown the muffin sugar. Pan? <laughs> he has said that like six times guys. <laughs> top, top it with brown sugar and cinnamon and pop them in the oven and then we will get started on some dinner. Yes, I just, know the muffin pan. <laughs> Do you know the muffin pan? We just texted all of the teenagers to start making their way home. Ooh. Jude finished youth group and he's over at the basketball court. Um, Liam is actually gonna be later so he won't be here for this but Penelope, I think is feeling a little bit better. I'm gonna go check on her in just a minute. And I think Reese and Kira are gonna come too. They went for a drive and to pick up a couple things from the store, so. Um, Link, Mr. Lincoln here has been hard at work, still coloring. This is like the perfect activity for him when I'm baking, because I can keep an eye on him. You want some more of this one? Okay. And um, so, so it definitely keeps him occupied and that's really nice because this one is busy. He can get into some messes if I'm not watching him closely. Also, I've never made this exact recipe and I just realized this is a massive amount. <laughs> like, this is a massive amount. It this is, is gonna be like, like 10 pans of yeah. muffins or something. <laughs> It'll be I need to go buy some more muffins. Enough pans. for the week, I think. The yeah. muffin pans. We're gonna eat muffins every single day this week. The spice of my life is putting on the spice of the muffins. What does that even mean? <laughs> it means you make things spicy. <laughs> Jude walked in. Just to hear. It's like, why? Why do I have to do these kinds of things? It does smell really nice in here, it though. Does. It smells very much like cinnamon. Just apple. like you. You smell like cinnamon, apples, sugar. Okay, sugar cinnamon, and spice, spice, and everything, everything nice. nice. How hey. was basketball time? Good. Yeah, did well, you, you score all the goals? <laughs> it, yeah, you were very, very sweaty, dude. Unreal. I 
have no idea what you guys are talking about. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, honest opinion. Do these smell good? Do they look good? I mean, they're not baked. Holy yes. monkey. What is that? That's mine. Hey, you were, on home, you were home on time! <laughs> Jude has been so responsible lately, he's yeah. setting an alarm. If we tell him, like, come home at a certain time, he sets an alarm to make sure that he comes home on time, and apparently you work. But, as I was saying, do they smell good? Yeah, sure. <laughs> hey, if you, if you they, smell them close enough, they might get a little saltier. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> they, they're, they're going to taste delicious in just a few minutes. Good job, Good job, guys. Perfect. Nice. <laughs> Nothing like a high five with an oven mitt, right? It's a nice soft high five. Mm -hmm. Well, beautiful people, the queen of baking has done an inordinate amount of work today. <laughs> I am, and to be 100% honest, I'm getting a little hangry. So I'm like, yeah, gonna pass like... this vlog off to Steven. I told him, I was like, I'm feeling like lightheaded and yeah. I'm just getting cranky. Like I, I need to eat something, but I don't want to eat something because it's almost dinner time. Yes. So I was like, please just rescue me. I'm just me like, I'm gonna like, do this thing. Make a delicious make the food. <laughs> Though what is it? What would? What are we gonna call this? Like the summer, Thanksgiving in the summer? Summer Thanksgiving sandwich? I don't know. I don't know, but whatever it is. Comment down food. below what you call this sandwich. They don't know what the sandwich is going to be. Well, yet. I'm going to show you the sandwich. You have to keep watching. But as soon as you're done watching, you'll need to comment with ideas on what this sandwich should be called. And maybe we'll like send you a prize if we choose to call <laughs> this sandwich what you've commented and suggested that it should be called. Oh my god. Maybe we'll send you a sandwich. Wow. I just. My sandwich? I just want to eat right now. Yeah, so. I'll do it quick. I'll go quick. This will be fast. And how are the teenagers doing up here? Fine. <laughs> Did you know Dad's making some really delicious dinner right now? He is. Oh. He is. It's not going to be ready for a little bit, but he's getting started on it, and I'm so excited. That would be pretty nice. How are you feeling? A little bit better. A little bit better. Better than this morning. So Penelope's had a bit of a stomach ache today, and just overall not feeling great. You think you're going to be okay for school tomorrow? Or? Yeah, I'll be totally okay. some peaches down to a little bit of a chutney that I'm going to put on the sandwich. We've got a fresh brie here that's going to go on there. Just some uh, normal sliced, fairly thick sliced turkey. And uh, we got this fresh sourdough bread uh, from Whole Foods today. They sliced it for us there. So I've got that. I'm going to use a little bit of Kerrygold butter. It's a super, super simple sandwich. But uh, it's really, really, I think, I think it's gonna be tasty. I hope it's gonna be tasty. I've never tried it with peaches before. I've always done cranberry. Uh, but the good news is there will be probably plenty of this peach left over uh, to do some extra sandwiches after this is all done. So hopefully it turns out really well. Normally this sandwich would actually have like some alfalfa sprouts on it, but everywhere we looked, again, no alfalfa sprouts. I don't know if this is like a supply chain issue thing or just out of season, can't figure it out. I think it's still gonna be a great sandwich though. Hey buddy, you excited to try the sandwich? Come here. Like, are you excited to have the sandwich? Hey, <laughs> you're so excited. <laughs> oh, He's been yeah. stalking it like a, I know. a bird of prey, just Let's ready share. to pounce. Share the first one, we'll share another one later. <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs> what do you think of that guy? Okay. <laughs> what do you think of that, bebe? Mm. How is it with the peach? That's good. Yeah, it doesn't have the same pop of color, but I think it probably tastes pretty that good. That has a really good flavor, though. Yeah. That is so good. <laughs> You're so <Yeah>. happy. <laughs> He's like, you're gonna have like. Mom, did you see this sandwich Dad made? <laughs> you are so silly. <laughs> I think we have a winner. Mm. All right, people still got to comment down below what we should call this thing. Oh! You... <laughs> oh man! Come sit down with us. <laughs> there you go. Dude, that crunch. 
from the group. <laughs> like, Lincoln's like, can you give me also some of that? Lincoln keeps saying more, <laughs> more. more. Yeah. What do you think, bud? It's good. Judah's our sandwich connoisseur. I feel like you're kind of the sandwich guy at the home. So if you like it, that means it's probably a pretty decent sandwich. More. More. How is it, guys? Good. Good. Does that not make like the most delicious sandwiches ever? Yeah. Yeah. I've had one, and I'm. Probably gonna have another one. I, I didn't share with Lincoln though, so. You did. You but gave him probably one. most of your sandwich, but. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And then the muffins turned out really good as well. The they did well. Plowing through them. I, I left them in a little too long because I totally forgot. Lincoln and I went outside to play on the trampoline, so the first batch was a little bit. It's a little, good. it's like, it's still good, like it's soft on the inside. It looks the, great. The top it looks is still great. a little bit overdone. But Put a little Kerrygold like, on it. More patches, so. I know, right? having their second sandwich. Not, uh, not everybody, but I yeah. think it was like, most of us. <laughs> a few of us are having it. <laughs> I, have no idea what you're talking about. Uh, I think it's a hit. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, beautiful people, we are gonna go and close this thing out because it is a school night and yeah. we're all full and ready yeah, to fall asleep. <laughs> we already put Linky to bed. It's yeah. time for Ethan to go to bed. Yeah. Kids are all brushing their teeth, getting showers, all that good stuff. It's just different when it's like a school night, like school yes. routine versus summer routine. I feel like we're still kind of getting into that. Sunday Trying nights. to, yeah. Yeah, Sunday nights like get away from you and then you're like, oh my gosh, it's 8.30, like we gotta go to sleep right now. So, <laughs> yeah. yeah, so anyway, we love you guys. Can't wait to see you next time. It's a big week this week. We've got all kinds of stuff going on. We've got it. some stuff with Penny that we're gonna update you on. We've got mm -hmm. uh, Judy's birthday is coming up this week as well. Just stick all the Sixteen, guys. Oh my gosh. Yeah, lots of coming <sighs> up too. Your birthday's coming up in October, though. That's, That's right. A couple, a couple months. Couple months away, right? Yeah. Anyway, we love you guys. We will see you next time. Bye. Bye. For your namesake, you will.